today we're dealing with Texas winter, or rather South Texas winter. Freeze again! Um, yeah, it's gonna get down to like 14 tonight, tomorrow, and that's damn cold for Houston. So, I've got a video on recycling pool noodles to protect your faucets. Uh, I also have installed a uh, valve to let air in, and I have cut off the hot and cold water where they come into the garage, and that deals with my outdoor sink. There's a video about that, by the way. And it also deals with this faucet that's over here, and generally that solves most of my headaches associated with water and cold. So, I've still got a couple things that I can't just wrap and I need to protect. So I'm gonna build some boxes out of some styrofoam sheet. I bought it for something else, but hey, I'm glad I have it because it's fixing to be useful. So I've measured what I need to build and I need to have 14 wide, 27 tall, and eight deep. So let me show you how I do that. First, we're gonna start by clearing some space, which means throw this junk over here. I really need to deal with that dust. fish hooks on the end of this for as easy as it is to manage a school. Get those out of the way. So 27 plus 6, or 14 plus 16 is 30, so that's how deep this needs to be. And you should be able to cut this with a box knife. Alright, so that gives me my approximate, so 
size. There's one lousy piece. There's another lousy piece. So let me uh, go get something, I'll be right back. All right. I'm going to use a hot glue gun to glue these together. I was looking for the last hour and a half for the other hot glue sticks that, when they're needed, go into hiding. They're in, like, the hot glue protection program. Anyway, let me check the ridiculous price of electricity here in Texas, where our deregulated market is designed to enrich the thieves that run energy companies. Because ERCOT doesn't have any teeth, and PUC doesn't dare stand up to industry to actually protect the consumers because they are toothless lapdogs. Anyway, let's see if we can get this together. Not yet, but you get the general idea. But we don't have enough fucking hot glue. Alright, let me go see if I can find it, because now i got to have it. Different. I'm going to screw the damn thing together. With scrap, scrap wood. Should have done this an hour and a half ago. I'm using flanged screws. Fortunately, the 
this does not have to be, you know, Antarctic proof. And we're talking about a couple days of cold weather. getting there now. We're actually starting to accomplish something. Hot glue part is not to it anyway. Oh, it looks like this might be something else that stucco tape will stick to. Because it doesn't stick to stucco or masonry. At least not any of the masonry on my house. deal with the damn tree roots. So I need to make another little piece for here and something to push against this. So let me go do that. I'll be right back. All right. So I've got a board here to prop this. 
and my uh, heat pump's going into defrost mode. So, just don't mind all the noise. to make this as reasonably airtight as possible because that's probably going to be the difference between it staying warm and not. I know it doesn't look pretty, but it doesn't have to. side. She ain't pretty, but it will probably work. 